Econine is sponsored by your Washington area Toyota dealers. The environment matters to all of us here at WUSA 9, and we know that it matters to you as well. And that's why tonight we want to shine a spotlight on DC Plant Week. It's a celebration of all things green, and you can get in on the fun. Meteorologist Michaela Lucero is showing us how she showing us how she's at Rewild Plant Shop with tonight's Eco 9 segment. This week marks the third annual DC Plant Week. DC Plant Week is just a celebration of plants. But this blossoming event is that you don't have to be a botanist to have a plant collection that excites you. Was on its way to being uprooted. In years one and two uh, were hosted by Little Leaf. Uh, so Amanda McClements, who owns Salt and Sundry, started DC Plant Week via Little Leaf. And unfortunately, Little Leaf is no longer in operation. And so I got in contact with her just to see what was going on with DC Plant Week because it was such a success in these past couple years. Now under the leadership of Lillian Cox. And she offered it to me, basically. <laughs> she offered it to Rewild to kind of take up the mantle. And we felt that, uh, you know, we're, we're, we're honored to be able to do that. DC Plant Week is thriving, offering classes, events, and connection opportunities for every kind of plant person. You can be a casual, plant curious beginner. You can be a pretty experienced hobbyist, or you know, perhaps even more than that, you could be a miniature greenhouse owner in your own space. Um, there's, but you know, regardless of your level of experience. There's just so many ways to connect with people over a love of nature, which is so universal. Plant Week runs through Saturday, and if you can't make it out this year, Cox is already planning for the 2025 season. Possibly DMV Plant Week in the future. From Rewild, it's so excited to see how this event grows organically. <laughs> oh, like something else we know. I'm meteorologist Michaela Lucero, WUSA 9.